Jolly Molly Wong here, and welcome to another episode. <laughs> okay, again. Hi, everyone. Welcome to another episode of Jolly Molly. B what? Okay, again. Hi, everyone. It's Jolly Molly Wong here, and welcome to another episode of Trying Something Bizarre. For this episode, you will see that I have applied it really heavy makeup for me it's quite heavy i don't really put on makeup that much yeah so heavy makeup and the reason for this it's because uh we no not we i am going to try some really weird color lipstick and hopefully it looks good on me <laughs> so yes uh, we are going to try some really weird color lipstick. So when you, when you see some really weird color lipsticks, have you ever you know thought, what would you look like if you apply these lipsticks? Or when you see you know fashion shows models where they apply like silver color lipstick, golden color lipsticks, have you ever imagined what would you look like if you applied those color lipstick? For me, I don't really apply uh, lipstick other than than chapstick chapstick to protect my lips the reason for that i feel like my lips are already red enough i didn't apply any lipstick here okay it's red enough for me for me so i'm quite satisfied with my color the lips of my own color therefore i barely put on any lipstick however i'm really interested in trying colors that are not the same as my lips so that's why recently i have trying to collect different colors of lipstick that are weird that is abnormal to a lot of people and yeah i did find them these are all the lipstick that i found so yeah um also i've also um tried to find ways to diy my own lipstick to you so that i can try different colors uh without spending a lot of money because you know trying to find weird color lipstick these cost so much and i really want to save some money while i still can try something really new and bizarre which is something that i like so um i just decided to find some DIY projects and I did find it so for this video you will see that I have divided into part one and part two for part one I will be doing a lipstick haul where I will show you all the weird color lipstick that I've bought and for part two I mainly focus on some DIY lipstick where I will be using these so if you are curious about uh, how I am I going to DIY lipsticks well, do also check out part two. So, let's start with the lipstick haul. First, I would say that I would start with the first weird lipstick that I've tried, which is this by Topshop. So yeah, you can already see the price. It's 99 Hong Kong dollars. Uh, it's quite pricey for me. Yeah, And it's a death. So it's like uh, this color quite dark i always wanted to try dark color lipstick my mom would always say that uh dark color lipstick would probably make me look that i'm po being poisoned or i'm a zombie because if you've seen uh, some hong kong movies you will know that zombies are usually have black lipstick and they're like <laughs> and they jump around like this so yeah this is a black, perhaps, I think it's a, like a purple, a bit purple lipstick here. Um, and I'm going to try it. So yeah, let's start with this. So yeah, this is the lipstick. And um, the, cover, the cover of it is quite nice. And yeah, this is that color. You can see that clearly. So it's like brown. I think brown instead of purple. And it, it has a really nice chocolate smell. It smells really like chocolate. Oops. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to first swatch it here. So it looks like this. Can you see it? Can you see it? Yes. So it's here. And I'm going to apply it onto my lips right now. Big review. 
review of the final product of my lips with this color. <laughs> oh my god! Let's have a close look. Oh my god. Well, personally, I love it. It's like a totally different style for me. Uh, <laughs> and it's really weird, this color. Oh my god, it looks so good when I don't smile. It looks so cool. When I smile, it's like so much weirder. I shouldn't smile when I apply these. Like really cool girl. Hey. See? It's much better when I don't smile. <laughs> so for the second lipstick. For this one, I have in fact bought two and these are from the same brand which is NYX 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 Yes, and it's called a Macron Lippy A Macron Lippy, I quite like the name And for this one you have really weird color and I ordered two of those weirdest colors that I can find This one, it's quite popular It's called Sesame, it is a grey color can see this is a gray color I'm gonna swatch it it looks like this yeah it looks like this I'm going to apply this to show you what it look like uh, yeah. now let me review the final look of this lipstick <laughs> well, personally, I think let's have a close look. I mean, you can see it's quite moisturized and it's you know it's easy to apply. It's good, the texture is nice. However, for the color, I don't think it's really it really suits me that much. Perhaps it's because it's a bit weird for me. Or per perhaps because my skin is too white, if I could, you know, have darker skin, it will look much, much better. So it's like the silver color, but without the sparkly. So yeah, my mom would probably say that I look like one of those people in, who's sick in the movie and they're lying there with their lips very white. Don't! Don't leave me. I'm sorry I have to leave you. You know one of those Korean dramas? Uh, I look like them right now. Uh, if I'm going to pretend that I'm really sick, perhaps I should pr apply this lipstick on. As I've said just now, this is also from the same brand, uh, similar price, and from NYX. And I'm going to swatch it. So this just have to look... This, uh, I would say, when I look online, it looks like blue, uh, according to their photo. But when it came here, it looked a bit like purple. Yeah, purple. Uh, which I was quite disappointed at first. But look how, uh, after I swatched this. So, um, let's say, okay, it doesn't look good. So this is the color of the swatching. It looks like a bit like purple, right? I'm not sure whether this camera can show you, but it looks a bit purple. Uh, which online, it's, it shows that it's light blue. So when it arrived, I was, I was checking whether they got me the wrong thing, but no. So they call it violet, but let's see what it, uh, the effect, what's the color of it when it's on my skin. Like on my lips, not skin. Yeah, on my lips. So yeah, I'm gonna apply this right now. Okay, so now it is the review of this color lipstick. So um, personally, I'm quite satisfied with this color. Uh, even though it's as light, like similar to this light color, however, it's more obvious, even though my skin might be quite white. Let has, let's have a closer look. I like it. 
I really like it. Um, so even though it's not the blue color that I've expected, but it's like a purple and it's quite pretty. So now let's do our last two lipstick colors. For these are two that I bought last week, just last week, that, uh, that I was so surprised with. This is from H&M. Yes, H&M Beauty uh, product line and I was so uh, surprised by it because for H&M I always buy clothes from it I never knew there was a beauty line until recently so I was so sh surprised when I found it out and when I found these colors I was even much surprised like even more surprised about it so these are the two that I've chosen so these are $99 Hong Kong dollars for each and then they I bought these two colors two colors one is called you are golden so I think you might have guessed what the color is that and one it's called uh, bur burnished bronze so once again you might have guessed what's the color of it so yeah first of all I think I would probably try this because this is the color that I'm much more excited about Okay, so it looks like this. Ooh, fancy gold. This is from H&M, the H&M. And then let me show you. Ooh, gold, gold, the golden color. And it has spark, some sparkly things on it. Hopefully it looks sparkly on my lips. So let's swatch it first. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Why is it even lower? Like this, uh, this, this. Let's do it. Can you see it? Can you see it? Yes, this is the color. This is the color. It has a sparkly color. Can you see it? Oh my god, it looks so pretty. I wonder what it looks like when it's on my lips. I can't wait. Let's apply it. review the final look of this lipstick just as what I expected it looks good for me I think personally I think I really love it a lot of gold on my lips I look like the one of those people in the capital right now in Hunger Games really good and lips I really love it I personally think that I could really apply this when I go out uh, but the only problem for me when I apply it you have to apply like a lot of layers of it or else it will look like you have really red like uh, still remain the red color of your lips while you have some sparkle on it so uh, to put it to give it a better effect you have to you know apply it a few more layers to make it more obvious the gold now I am going to apply this brown color so let's take it out take it out one is again very fancy case for us let's open it Ooh. Mm, doesn't smell good <laughs> I think the one that smells so good would be the top shot one that smells like chocolate Others doesn't really smell good, but look at this color. Oh my god, OMG! It's sparkly once again. I love sparkly lipsticks. It's weird, but it's pretty. Swatch it, swatch, swatch. So. <gasps> Oh my god, I'm so sad right now. I tried to swatch it. Is it because I'm too... <gasps> it didn't happen to my gold. Oh. Why is this happening to me? Okay. I'm gonna swatch it here. It looks like this. Quite sparkly, quite pretty. And it ended up like this. 
Okay, I'm gonna use another brush. I'm gonna use a brush to apply this lipstick on. <laughs> The final product. It doesn't look bad. It looks good. And it's sparkly. Like the golden one. I already find out the reason why I broke it. It's because I, I, I got it out too much and I just didn't remember to put in before I swatch. So... It broke, but still I managed to put it back to like this. So it looks like this right now. It's new and it looks bad. You can see the gap here. Oh. It looks bad, but still they have the color in it. So I'm going to carefully use it right now, from now on. It looks really good. I mean, it's... Um, it's quite easy to apply on, unlike the golden one. It doesn't, you know, you don't have to apply a lot of layers. It already has got the, like, the color on it. It's brown, it's prettier. So it's a brand new style. It's not the same as the first one, the dark color. It's also dark color, but it's, you can be less cool. Yeah, you can be less cool, you can style. Instead of being, like, really cool. So this one for the dark color, it re it makes you look, the whole person look really serious. But this one, not necessary. It looks quite cool as well. And probably I would wear it outside. Even though it's not normal for a lot of people. But it looks good. So yeah, I'm quite satisfied with this color. And I really love it. Unfortunately, I broke it. I broke it. Okay, so this is the end of first part at the end of the lipstick haul where I broke a lipstick and try on some really really weird color <laughs> yeah I broke a lipstick so yeah here uh, are all the lipstick that I've got uh, do comment below and tell me what you think about it if you have tried do tell me about your feelings as well and also tell me whether you think uh, these colors suits me or not and Perhaps, you know, which color suits me the bow most and then yeah, something like that. And also you can probably tell me what kind of outfit that I can um, match uh, when I apply a certain color of weird color lipstick. Yeah, all of these I would really love to know. I would really love to learn how to apply weird color lipstick beautifully. So yeah. Do tell me about it and do comment below and if you like this part of this video please give me a big thumbs up and remember to subscribe and yeah here's a button where you can check out part two where i diy uh my lipstick and try on other bizarre colors other than these that i have bought <laughs>